Out of the gun on third and 12. The Giants have to get to the 41 to keep the drive going, and that's just where Manuel makes the catch. He caught it inbound and picked up exactly what he needed. Pop, Hampton, and Carson are the running backs, and the handoff is to Hampton, who threads his way for a first down to the 49er 47. Dave Weimer makes the tackle. For a touchdown in a preseason game. Jim Burt, the former Giant, is in as the 49ers nose tackle, and it's Hampton finding room again. And close to a first down, he's tackled by Ronnie Lott. It's Carthen come right in there late and pick somebody off. On second and short, it's Anderson picking up the first down over the left side as OJ takes it to the 34 yard line from the 29. That's Ingram in motion. Sims from the gun, he gives it to Megan, and Megan can't get outside. Charles Haley stops him at the 34-yard line. Well, Haley got so far upfield that the kickout is really the block. You kind of get the feeling that there's a big play or a mistake looming out there somewhere. Mm -hmm. Landetta's kick taken at the 20. This is Taylor chased by reasons. Look out! And John Taylor has Landetta to beat and can't beat him. Landetta oh. makes the tackle at oh. the 47. That's John. a great play by Landetta. <laughs> Second and eight from the 49 or 49. Montana rolling to buy time and now decides to run and out of bounds he goes at the 45 yard line about three yards shy of the first down. He was chased by Lawrence Taylor. It's a long two. Craig in motion. And Montana throws too high, intended for Taylor. Covered on the play by Myron Geisen. Think of January, the loser of tonight's game would have to play an extra playoff game. On third and 11, Sims throws incomplete, and the Giants will be forced to kick from deep in their own territory. Greg Cox put the blitzing pressure on that time. <laughs> This is the sixth punt of the game, and it's a liner caught by Taylor at the 46 and brought back to the 39. So the 49ers clearly have their best field position of the night. Third and 10 from the 38. Mike Wilson goes in motion. Blitz. He gets it off. It's caught by Harry Sidney inside the 30-yard line. First down to the 26. Mark Collins makes the stop on the 31-year-old veteran who's playing very well in a spot role for the 49ers lately. Score early second quarter. Craig still can't get anything going. Marshall and Guyton are right there to double team him. Should go. But generally speaking, yeah. you don't know. Second and long. Here's Craig making the catch and taking it to the 10-yard line for a first down. And a flag is down at the end of the play. <laughs> Holding. Number 44 of the offense. Repeat second down. Fullback Tom Rathman. Six-yard line. Montana fires and it's knocked down at the 15-yard line by Greg Jackson who nearly picked it off. Full. No good. Kofer wide to the left. 49ers come up short. Sidney goes in motion. Four-man rush. Montana needs help. Improvises. Throws it away again. And we are set for our eighth punt of the night. Very inartistic. And it plots is down at the 43-yard line. Second and six. Sims. It's caught by Bavaro. It's a first down, and Lott rides him down at the 29-yard line. And there is your first haymaker. 23-yard pickup. And number 30. Sims in the gun. 49ers rush six. And that opens it up for Ingram over the middle. He takes it to the 19. Very close to a first down. Don Griffin makes the tackle. And it is a first down for New York. Then make it. Make it in motion. And they even send Hampton into the pattern. And Sims releases, and it's deflected and caught by Stephen Baker after it bounced off the hands of Rodney Hampton. First and goal at the three. Anderson behind some blocking, but no room at all. Stopped at the two and a half. Down who spent 
part of 1982 with the 49ers boots it through so finally some points up on the board a 20-yard field goal for Matt Barr culminates this drive with 326 remaining in the half first down 49ers at the 36-yard line here's Craig for a gain of five up to the 41 yard line Eric Howard and Pepper Johnson converge on the stop 305 Taylor split left Montana goes underneath to Craig he has a first down he's inside the giant 40 and he's run down at the 27 by Greg Jackson three nothing New York first and ten at the 28 yard line Roger Craig Taken down by Gary Reasons after a gain of five to the 23-yard line. Second and five at the 23. And Montana fires into the end zone. Touchdown, Taylor. You can stop them for a long time, but sooner or later you keep going to them, they're going to get you. What a pair of weapons. You saw Montana, he pump fake to Jerry Rice. That kept the safety from dropping into the coverage. That was Everson Walls who had the deep hole, you can see here, but he went for the pump fake to Rice. Montana comes off, and Collins with man for man could not stay with Taylor. Taylor with his sixth touchdown reception this year. 7-3, 49ers with a minute and a half to go in the half. When the Giants get the ball back, they have two timeouts for me. 43-yard line, Haley is back in the game. Here's a little flea flicker. And Phil Sims has Ingram open, and he makes the catch at the 35-yard line. Covered by Pollard, first down New York. And at the 35. Here comes Let's Haley. Knocked out. Loose ball. Three red shirts are surrounding it. I think Charles Haley is the guy, Al, that knocked the ball out. That's a good bet with the 49ers. Dennis Brown is at the bottom of that pile, too. 49er football. That pile with the football at the end. Carter turns it up for six. Stopped by Pepper Johnson at the 47-yard line. Canton, Ohio, no question about that. Second and five. And it's a low pass and caught by Taylor at the 50. Gain of four, third and one. Mark Collins, who's been spending most of his night covering Rice, covers Taylor on this one. Sidney and Rathman are the running backs. They need a yard, and Sidney gets that yard. And nine more to the 40 behind a Rathman block first down. Go third quarter, 7-3, 49ers. First down, Carter. To the 35-yard line, Pepper Johnson makes the tackle. See, well, right now, the way the Giants have been moving the ball, if the 49ers score again, I mean, it's... I haven't seen enough life from New York offensively to play a lot of good comeback football here in the fourth quarter. And that was a third and four play, and Roger Craig dropped it. Roger Craig back in the game after being shaken up earlier in the half, and there are the numbers through the first 45 minutes of play, <laughs> including Kugler, Burt, and Fagan. First down from the 20. Sims keeping it. And Phil picks up the first down with a nimble little move out to the 31-yard line, a gain of 11. Sims over the middle, Bavaro. He takes another pop but holds on at the 44-yard line. Romanowski and his good buddy, Ronnie Lott. <laughs> We're right. On second and nine. Sims buys some time, throws, Bavaro makes the catch. They swing him out of bounds at the 49 of San Francisco. Romanowski gets credit for the tackle, and that's going to set up a key third and three with 12.44 to go. Flank to the left off the quick count. It's a conservative third and three call, and there's no room at all over the left side. Taylor thinks about calling the fair catch, does it, and the Giants get a most fortuitous <laughs> bounce. John just got off Bill Parcell's hook. Well, they're over $500,000. 49ers on first down from the two, and it's the tight end, Brent Jones, who gets them out of the shadow of the goalpost down to the 20-yard line. Completion to Jones from the 19-yard line. Here's Dexter Carter. He slips down back at the 15 on the soft 
divoted turf, Banks and Washington. Well, if he didn't, he is in the backfield behind Montana. He goes into the pattern. Pass is caught by Jones, and the tight end is taken out of bounds up at the 23-yard line. Jones has caught three balls tonight for 31 yards. 49ers have to get to the 29 to keep the drive going, and open and dropping it <laughs> is jo Jones. Sure enough, All it right. stole his virtues. He drops one. First down from the 35. New York down by four. Sims airing it out, and it's incomplete. Good coverage on the play intended for Ingram, and it's Daryl Pollard right there with him. By Daryl Pollard. Second and ten from the 35-yard line. Here's Rodney Hampton, who gets taken down by a quartet of 49ers, led by Pete Kugler after a gain of one on an odd call. Third and nine, 45 remaining in regulation. Sims a big third down completion to the 49-yard line to Lionel Manuel, tackled by Ronnie Lott. And look at Ronnie Lott, look at Daryl Pollard. Get back on top of the receiver. Yeah, it was not a pick or anything. He should have been closer. Yeah. First and 10, 49-yard line. Sims gets taken down at the 42. Picked up, though, by Anderson. And he turns what would have been a disastrous play into a huge break. We're going to have to put a couple of these into the playbook. They've been the big plays for the Giants tonight. Charles Haley sacks Sims. It comes out. That time, it was Fagan. And Here's both times, number 24 is there to get their old bacon out of the fire. And he picks up four. Zach G won't get it done. Second and six at the 27-yard line. Sims over the middle. It's Cross who gets pushed back after reaching the 20. That's enough for a first down. Waymer makes the tackle. Clock ticks down to 625. First down of the 20. Sims dumps it off to Carthen, who is wide open, and Maurice Carthen goes to the 11-yard line. Tackled by Millen. Second and short upcoming. Anderson fights his way for what I think is a first down. Waymer makes the tackle, and it is. First and goal, New York from inside the 10. Sims is pressured and throws it away. Sims was under heavy heat from Michael Carter. Nobody picks Carter up. Sims says, who's supposed to block that guy? Sims too deep, intended for Ingram in the corner, covered by Don Griffin. Third and goal. Baker to the left, Ingram to the right. And Sims over the middle, knocked away. Ronnie Lott knocked it away. And a very big decision now for Parcells, intended for Bavaro. Parcells is down by four. If you kick a field goal, you still have 359, and you're then within a field goal of winning the game. Where do you get goal from the gun? Sims fires, batted away. Daryl Pollard. What a night for the 49ers secondary. Sims tried to get it to Manuel. A one-point game. I don't... I I think it's a no-brainer. I kicked the field goal. Here's Carter. This kid's having a pretty good night here. Remember Stelling Craig, who was slightly shaken up. Dexter Carter, the rookie, the number one draft choice out of Florida State. On eight. 49ers at the 21. Inside handoff to Harry Sidney, who turns it back, picks up the first down, and the former school teacher, who was cut twice earlier in his career, was a big star in the USFL, was looking for a job, sent his resume to John McVay, has just made a huge play. And have the better conference record. Second and six. And uh, Dexter Carter gets shoved back. Rejected, I think. <laughs> <laughs> yes. 11. From the 31-yard line. And they're going to keep it on the ground. A flag goes down. I think Carter has the first down. He gets up, both guns blazing, and then he sees the flag. But when the umpire throws that flag, you can pretty well guess what it's going to be. And I can't recall a holding penalty this whole game. Holding, number 61 in the offense. Repeat third down. And extremely conservative. Here's another flag. It's a big run for Sydney. It's not enough for a first down. But a marker is down. If nothing else, these two plays have taken 13 seconds off the clock. We have 135. Again a hold. Oh. 
Mega at his own 48. Takes it to the 44. That stops the clock. 36 seconds and no timeouts for New York. Get to the end zone. Out of the gun. 49ers rush three. Over the middle. This is Mega. He's taken down at the 37. No timeouts. Clock still running. To bed. Second and three. Again, a three-man rush. It's Megat again over the middle, and Megat takes it down to the 26-yard line. But here are the Giants with maybe one player remaining. He's got to throw it into the ground here, and he does, to give them that one play they can set up for. And he'll have to take it into the end zone, since in their wide receivers. Last play of the game, barring a defensive penalty. Well, this will draw a crowd. It and did. it ends on a sack by Fagan. And the 49er defense, nothing short of excellent. They dominated this football game. They won this football game on a team where the offense gets all the glory and all the stories. Ronnie Lott and his boys won this football game. Lott and his boys and Bill McPherson, the unheralded defensive coordinator, and they win it as well for... The defensive secondary coach, Ray Rhodes, who had his appendix removed, isn't here watching this one from the hospital. 7-3 is the final. 49ers win it. They're 11-1. Giants, 10-2. Next week, from Detroit, Raiders-Lions, Al Michaels, Frank Gifford, Dan Deirdre. Good night from San Francisco.